stop scoring ladies and watch this till the very end this might save your pregnancy today let's talk about preterm labor most women miss the earliest signs of preterm labor and by the time they reach the hospital the cervix is already dilated so here's what you must watch out for persistent lower back pain period like cramps pelvic pressure increase in watery discharge new onset spotting these are not normal pregnancy pains these are red flags now who is at higher risk women with previous preterm birth previous second trimester losses cervical surgeries repeated dncs uterine anomalies ivf pregnancies or pregnancies with twins or multiple gestation your ultrasound also can predict risk early key findings include short cervix which is less than 2 and 1/2 cm before 24 weeks funneling sludge or dynamic cervix in doubtful cases we do serial cervical length monitoring every 1 to 2 weeks now let's talk about treatment progesterone is a game changer it's a hormone when used correctly can prevent preterm losses the general progesterone is proven beneficial in short cervix prior preterm birth some ivf high risk pregnancies it helps stabilize the uterus and support cervical integrity then comes cerclage there are different types of cerclages history indicated cerclage ultrasound indicated cerclage rescue or emergency cerclage when the cervix is already open and for women with extremely short or surgically damaged cervix laparoscopic cerclage offers excellent success rates but remember these decisions are never one size fits all always consult your gynecologist immediately if you notice any warning signs early action saves pregnancies share this with someone who needs it thank you